In this video we're going to take a look at how to uh, put a drop cap at the beginning of a paragraph. A drop cap is that big capital letter that you frequently see on the first word of the first paragraph of a chapter. And it is easy to do in Word. Uh, it's an option on the insert command and it is over here in the text group. Uh, and here it is, drop cap. And you've got two choices. You can uh, do a dropped or you can put it in the margin and that one looks kind of funny I think so we're going to choose dropped and what Word actually does is it creates a little text box here for you and puts the letter inside the text box and uh, you can it's just ordinary text in here if you want to go in and, and you know change the font if you uh, don't like that particular font size you know you can you can pick something else and uh, so it's just ordinary text inside of a text box and uh, if you it, it uh, inherits its paragraph formatting from the paragraph that it's in which had a first line indent here so if you think that first line indent looks a little funny on this paragraph uh, then what you can do is you can uh, just move it back here make sure you're inside the text box when you do it and uh, it'll move it back to the left edge like that uh, you can also go in here, you know, and since this is ordinary text, you can do any of the ordinary um, formatting options. You know, you can change the font, you can change the style if I want to make that, that bold. Um, all of the stuff that you can do with, with ordinary text applies here as well. Um, and about the only other thing uh, that we need to take a look at here is uh, there are some options, but the options here are relatively simple. Uh, it lets you determine how many lines you want. The default here is three and how far from the left it's going to be. Um, but other than that, uh, uh, your options are pretty limited. So uh, that's it as far as putting a drop cap in. Uh, it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward thing to do.